This is your Knoxville Nationals recap for Wednesday, August 8th. Tonight started wet and fast, and the speeds never seemed to go away until the B and A mains. Logan Schuhart would take the quick time at a 14.933 over Kerry Matson and Aaron Reitzel. Heat races followed with Brady Bacon taking the first heat, Jamie Ball winning the second, Dominic Selzy scoring the third, Clyde Knipp would take the fourth, which was the heat that everyone was cheering about. Donnie Schatz, the 10-time Knoxville Nationals champion, would finish one spot out of the transfer in fifth and would have to run the B main. Brock Zierfoss would win the final heat of the night as we move on to the B main. Donnie wouldn't have it so easy as Logan Schuart would pass him and win the last chance race and Donnie transferring with him. Brock and Greg battled for the first couple of laps, ultimately ending in Hodnett taking the lead and pulling away. Tim Schaefer would catch Zierfoss and pass him for second a few laps later. Kyle Larson and Gio Selzy battled with Zierfoss for third, and both got around Zierfoss with Larson pulling away in third and catching Tim Schaefer. Greg Hodnett would continue his lead and win the qualifying night over Tim Schaefer and Kyle Larson. With all this up front happening, Donnie Schatz would work his way from 21st to 5th tonight, using the last restart to jump from 8th to 5th in turns 1 and 2. Uh, yeah, it was, uh, wasn't really anybody coming through them heats, and the racetrack stayed fairly narrow. Uh, we just weren't, weren't all that good. We just uh, didn't make the right adjustments with the car um, that we had in the past, and put ourselves in that B main. So uh, that's the way it goes sometimes. Uh, you know, we, we rebounded from that. Uh, at the end of the race, I felt like we were as good as anybody there, but uh, you know, just run so hard and abused everything so hard to get there that uh, well, put us in that spot. So that's the way it goes. Uh, this race is about attrition. Um, we, we're in the best spot we can be for tonight. You know, it's fifth, fifth, fifth. So uh, we'll see where that puts us, and uh, we'll come back Saturday and uh, be a lot better. The combined top 16 in points after both qualifying nights determines the locked-in 16 starters for Saturday's A main. Here's how your points look so far. This was your Knoxville Nationals recap for Wednesday, August 8th.